Know the fun cerusites from the Tsumeb mine in Namibia. Now this one has the strangest color, almost a reddishness to it. Lovely formation of cerusite. Now it can be displayed two ways around, but uh, to get perspective on this piece, I'm just going to move it around. Don't worry so much at this moment about the color. Just have a look at the crystal faces as they, as they reflect back. Give an indication there. Very difficult to read this guy. Then the top is terminated, as you can see over there, termination of sorts. Now, a, a, a point of display quite understandable to the serocyte, not quite reticulated, but, but heading that way, would be this, where you have these little blades jutting out. Now, let's look into the uh, color in this guy. It's a sort of a yellowish, brownish color. Of course, the serocyte's known for that, uh, some of them from the Tumeb mine. Uh, this is also crystalline. Now we're looking at the other side, but I'd, I'd actually prefer the, the top side um, or the way I had it around a minute ago. But it's different folks, different strokes. So uh, uh, I wonder if this is not a floater, but we're going to go with a cerocyte crystal at the moment. All the way from the old Sumeb mine in Namibia. Of course, Sumeb, well known for the lovely cerocytes which came out there. This one does have some color, so it's not clear. We find some interesting inclusions in the cerocytes from Sumeb. The more you magnify, you'll actually, the more you see. And uh, one of the magnificent things of Sumeb minerals is, first of all, they are aesthetic when held in hand, but the more you magnify, the more you see absolute magazine quality.